my exit was really interesting. Um, I, I wrote the letter, uh, sent it off, and was feeling very, very therapeutic about that. And then I immediately went and threw up everything in my stomach. And I went, kind of got up and, and thought, well, that, that must be the last of it. And I actually had to have a physical response. My body needed to physically eject the church and, uh, you know, flushed the toilet and moved on with my life. Well, how's your life now, now that you're a, a new ex-Mormon? Well, I, I feel great. I really do, except for the family situation. I can read anything I want. I don't have to ask as I go along with Mormonism. I can choose my own underwear. I don't have to wear temple garments. I can uh, have a cup of coffee if I want it. I don't have to uh, uh, follow strict orders and feel guilty all the time because I'm not going to the temple. I'm not doing my genealogy. Uh, I, I feel like a free man. Well, I don't think the church made me miserable. If I was still in the church today, I think I'd still be a happy guy. Uh, but one thing that I know for sure is that I have become more of a person than I ever dreamed possible um, since I left the church. I, I kind of relate my experience now being an ex-Mormon, being outside the church. It's like a great burden that's being lifted off me. I, I'm able to breathe easier. I'm able to sleep easier. Um, I can see clearer. Uh, it reminds me of going back to your elementary sc school where you know, the water fountains are too low and the classroom seems so small and nothing seems as big as it once was. And I, I really relate that to the Mormon church. It's, in retrospect, it seems so small, so petty. Um, and the world is such a bigger place, and now I can explore the four corners of it and really get to know the world in a way that being a Mormon didn't allow me. Life isn't, isn't a whole lot easier now for me. I, I have a, an incredibly wonderful marriage now, an incredibly passionate and intimate marriage and, and I'm so much more capable of being intimate with myself and with others now without the whole image machine of Mormonism uh, as kind of the my identity. Now that I'm out of the church uh, and my wife and my children are all out of the church as a family we feel we're just yeah happy that we've been in a long long time. Even though I didn't feel I was a judgmental person you just can't help it when you see someone behave in a certain way or dressing a certain way or if I would meet someone that was really nice I would judge them in a way saying you know I wish they they would listen to the church you know the church is true and, and I'd like to get them baptized because they'd make a really good Mormon and now I just view people I accept people for who they are. I live without fear now I live with an acceptance and an inner peace and a strong belief that I can be what I was destined to be and not changed into what a religion would want me to be.